It's Public Power Week, and this segment is sponsored by the Zeeland Board of Public Works. The municipally owned water and electric utility serves the city of Zeeland and its surrounding community. The Board of Public Works has been recognized nationally for superior safety, reliability, and system improvements. And get this, they offer retail electric rates among the lowest in the state of Michigan. Andrew Boatwright is the general manager of Zeeland Board of Public Works, and he joins us now to talk about the benefits of public power. And it's good to have you here. Great. Thank you for having me. You know, when I first heard Public Power Week, I thought, okay. Okay, but I have learned so much in talking to you all, but share with folks the benefits of municipally you know, owned and operated utility. Right. Well, you mentioned uh, that we have among the lowest rates in the state. That's, of course, the number one benefit. Other than that, I mean, reliability is really second to none. Our reliability statistics are fantastic. Uh, around 99.99% availability mm -hmm. year round. And that's really unusual for an electric utility. Now, I'll have to say that's partly because we're small, but uh, also because about 75% of our system in Zealand is underground. So that contributes greatly to mm. our reliability. Not only that, our dedicated team of 29 employees uh, who oversee 155 miles of overhead and underground distribution facilities, 36 mm -hmm. megawatts of uh, generating uh, capacity on system, as well as 55 miles of, of uh, water uh, distribution system. Um, those folks live and work uh, in the community and, and they are dedicated to serving our customers. Okay, so we hear a lot about rising uh, electrical costs, all, all utility costs, right? right. Um, electric vehicles, um, right. maybe even like some uh, deficiencies in, in capacity. Mm -hmm. Yeah, in capacity. So how are you dealing with all of that kind of coming down all at once? That's a big question. And uh, of course, those are issues that are top of mind for not only Zealand Board of Public Works, but all utilities across the country. Uh, in terms of rising costs, uh, we're all feeling that effect. And, and that's uh, driven primarily by natural gas prices uh, going up. And we're relying on natural gas for the predominance of our electric generation capacity uh, in, in this region and, and across the country. With regard to electric vehicles, we're implementing you know, ways that customers can manage these resources. Advanced metering, for example, that uh, measures two-way flow of electricity. And um, we've provided a, a tool that customers can use called MyMeter where they can get online on our web, through our website, zealandbpw.com, and um, view their usage in near real time, down to 15 minute intervals. Real quick, I wanna ask you about the uh, activities you have planned for Public Power Week. Oh, sure. What, what yes, you got going? Well, abso absolutely. Well, I'm here today talking to you, which is a big part of that. One of the things uh, we, we don't do very well is tell our story, mm. and um, Public Power, uh, is a great thing, um, obviously not available to everybody, only a select few communities who have decided to get into the electric utility business, like Zeeland. Um, we have um, uh, 40 of us in the state, 2,000 nationwide, and we, our charter is to be locally controlled, not-for-profit, and owned by our, cons our consumers. Hmm. So uh, we want to just tell our story. And that's get part it of it. There. And then the other piece is, we are um, uh, putting, putting a coloring contest out there for first through fourth uh, grade uh, uh, children. And, um, and that coloring contest, uh, the winner will be announced uh, uh, during the week of Public Power Week. Very nice, so. okay. We are going to spend the next week or so talking about the benefits of public power and allowing our local utilities to brag a bit about the exemplary service they provide. Congratulations and thanks for being here. Thank you.